Yeah! Welcome to my hood. That shit was banging right there. Everybody good? I can't hear y'all. Everybody good? That's what's up. I'm in a good mood too. Everybody paid their rent? No? Me neither. That's why I'm here now. They looking for me. I know every time I rent is due, I look for ways to, to cheat my manager. Every time I rent is due, I be like, hey, hey, my light switch don't work. Y'all need to take that off the rent. Y'all need to take that off the rent. It be stuff they can't even fix. I be like, hey, my neighbors had sex way too loud. Y'all need to take that off the rent. Y'all need to take that off the rent. I get desperate. I get desperate. Sometimes I have to shoot up my apartment complex just to keep the property value down. I cannot afford to have them go up on my rent. I be calling them up like, y'all hear the shooting? Y'all need to take that off the rent. Y'all need to take that off the rent. I just need a better job. That's what it is. I hate my job. I hate my job because you Is it cool? All right, well, fuck it. I am at Money Place. What do I expect? Huh? Shit just goes out. <laughs> take it off the rent, huh? Take it off the rent. That's my nigga right here. I like it. I'm going to take it to my next show. Oh, man. Uh, jobs, jobs just took the fun out of everything. Remember your email used to be fun? Until jobs start asking for it. Ten years ago, your email was cool. Until your job start asking for it. It was like, oh, shit, Mr. Lavender, we really like you. But in order to know if you got the job or not, we have to email you. Can I get your email address? I was like, oh, shit. You know, 10 years ago, my email address was something, something, something different, you know? I was like, well, you can't call me? She was like, no, it's company policy. I was like, well, uh, you can find me at uh, Dennis dot big black cock at AOL.com. Eh? <laughs> Do I still got the job? Do I still have the job? I'm trying to date, though. They just got tough, though. Dating is weird now. You know, everybody changed. Like, guys, guys are now sensitive. Guys are sensitive, and they think that's cool. Guys just cry all the time. Then they always try to bring Jesus in it. Like, Jesus wept. <laughs> yeah, but Jesus can bring back the dead. You know, you niggas work for Uber Lyfts. That shit is, that is not the same. Uber Eats is not the same. You know, girls, too. Girls are gangsters now. Girls are thugs. You know, that's not attractive. You know, I don't, I don't want to fuck a crip. You know, I don't want to have sex and be like, oh, shit, cuz. Oh, shit, cuz. This did good, cuz. You know, I just don't want to put my dick on the set. You know, I'm not. I'm not tough enough for that. You know, I'm, I'm not. You know, I'm not. I'm not about that life. I live a, a, a separate life. You know, I, like, recently stopped shopping at Walmart, you know, because I got tired of everybody wanting to check my receipt. It's so stupid. You just see me pay for it. Everybody want to check your receipt. The security guard, the janitor. It's stupid. It's so stupid. Because what I stole is in my pocket. It ain't even on my receipt. Now you just violating my privacy. That's, that's all you're doing. I actually discriminate during sex. Anybody discriminate during sex? Like if I feel like you're a 9 or 10, you know, I feel like I have to give you a 9 or 10 effort in the bedroom. The last girl I had sex with got mad at me. She was like, oh my God, you're done? That's it? I was like, well, you're a four. I'm not going to put that kind of wear and tear on my back for a four. But I fuck fours, though. See, ladies, I still, I, I still fuck fours, you know? Desperate times. Desperate times. I do. I do. All sex, all sex is just not created equal. Like, I'm like, real lazy when it comes to sex. I really am. And I look for ways to look like I'm working hard when I'm actually not. You know, all I, and I discovered if you just move your shoulders real fast when you fucking, no matter what you're doing, it just looks like you're doing a lot of work. All you got to do is just give her a little bit of shoulders. Like, yes. She think you're working hard, too. I'd be like, yes, I'm really in that. I am. I'm like a gas pump when it comes to sex. I really am. You ever put, like, $10 in your tank? How the meters start off real fast? That's like me. I, like, start off real fast. Then I like slow it down like 998, 999, 10. That's what I do. That's what I do. Let, fellas, you should do that with your girl. She think you made up a new sex move. She's like, oh my God, what was that? Oh, that was the pump number seven. You know, you ain't really, 
ready for the pump number seven. I don't knock our relationships, though. I really don't. I don't knock our relationships because if you're in a relationship, you know, you got a partner. You know, you got somebody that can help you with that, help you take that off the rent. You know, somebody, you got a teammate. You got a teammate. And if you're a guy, you know, sometimes, you know, guys, it, it works for guys because guys, you, you got the opportunity to just wake up in some pussy. When, you, when you're in a relationship, you could just roll over like, oh, shit, good morning. Would you like some breakfast? That's, a, that's, a, that's the kind of relationship you have. It's stupid, I know, I know it's stupid. I know, because we live like, we live, before I get out here, we live like in a smart world. You know, that's how they put the word smart on everything now? Like, you just can't have a regular phone. It got to be a smartphone. You can't be a regular car. It got to be a smart car. And everybody want to tell you why they have it, too. Everybody want to tell you. Everybody want to tell you why they have it. I know, just the other day, I seen this dude. I was like, hey, man, that's a nice little car you got. He was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not a little car. It's a smart car. You know, I got it because it's great on gas and good for the environment. Just be happy you got a car because Vegas is like the scooter moped capital. Everybody out here got a fucking moped. You know, I had to get me one. You know, my finances is fucked up. And this girl going to tell me, like, Dennis, I don't date guys with mopeds. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not a moped. It's a smart bike. You know, I got it because it's good on the gas. And my license is suspended. That's the only reason why I got it. All right, everybody, I'm Dennis Lazar. I'm out of here.